Hello and welcome back to Pure Accelerate 2019. I'm in the Pure Expo booth with Congruity 360. Steve McKay. Steve, how are you, sir? I'm doing great. How are you? Uh, wonderful. So tell me a little bit about what's going on here at the conference. I see customers coming in and asking you lots of questions. You guys are doing some risk mitigation. That, uh, it's blowing my mind. Tell me about what Congruity 360 is doing. Right, so today what we're showing is our classified 360 tool. And what it does primarily is classify all that data that our enterprise customers have no idea what's there. So they have terabytes, if not petabytes of data. And they have a lot of private data that, that they have unencrypted that they don't know about. And they are having a problem with that because when they get breached, they have hundreds of millions of their customers that they have to go and help out and identify what they did with their data, and then they have to pay fines. And what we're able to do is go in proactively, identify all that, prevent it from being continuously exposed, and allow them to securely put it off in some place where they should be able to put it off. So if I'm a customer, I have data in databases, in file shares, in, in applications, things everywhere. Data that might not need to be there or probably shouldn't be there. It's, it's from your point of view, it's a matter of classifying that and figuring out what the risks are? Right, exactly. So we would go in and scan all the data, and we create our own database and our own search index about the data, which allows us to run our analytics on it to identify what things are there. So we have our standard models and rules that we would use, as well as we work with the enterprise customers to identify what they have for their own specific reasons, how they want to identify and classify their data. And then we give them standard reports as well as customized reports to give them an information and key about what they have on all these storage devices. So one other example would be they have a bunch of old data that they don't need to keep. We would say it's been last accessed over 15 years ago. You don't have any regulatory reason according to your business rules to keep that. Why are you keeping it? And so we can identify all that. We create an audit trail for them. So if they have to deal with regulators, the judge, courts, opposing counsel, they can go to them and tell them uh, we have a process that identified this data, here's how we classified it, and here's what we did with it because of all of the regulations that we have to follow. Yeah, it, it, this, it's so interesting, and you mentioned regulations. This really touches every industry. This isn't industry specific. I mean, getting a, a feel for what that data is, that applies to everyone. Exactly, everybody from financial services, healthcare, and pharmas that are heavy regulated, sure. down to manufacturing, which you would see on the surface maybe not as heavy regulated, but there are things that they have to deal with, more maybe from OSHA or other things that they, so they just need to make sure that all of their data, their files, documents, are meeting all those regulations. So, any examples of places where, without giving us any company names, but where has, has this really been beneficial to customers? So, we worked with a healthcare company and they provide health insurance to a group of people up in the Northwest of the United States and they were breached a while ago and we went in. And That's helped. never a good thing, by the way. Never a good thing, but you know, it happens, breaches happen, but the thing is, is that they could have prevented some of their exposure by using a tool like Classify to go in and identify and classify that type of data that they should have secured and have encrypted. So when they do get breached, it's less likely that that data would be exposed to somebody looking at their data. I, and that's ultimately is to mitigate the risk. That's really what you guys are about. That's what we're doing is we're mitigating risk. Uh, and I see here the, there's a dashboard behind you with some yep. of the information on it. Tell me, are you running on-prem in the cloud? Does it matter where these things sit? It doesn't matter. So the data can be on-prem, it can be in the cloud, it can be hybrid. So like SharePoint runs on-prem, they can run up in the cloud. Our tool runs in the cloud. So what we're seeing right now, it's running in AWS. We can install it on-prem or we can run in a hybrid environment. Doesn't matter to us where today is, what the data is like, and where we run Classify. Yeah, and, and a lot of that too can offset storage costs in some cases, right? Exactly, so one of the first things we do uh, when we start scanning these repositories and looking at the data is that we do what we call rot analysis, the redundant, obsolete, and trivial data. So we've got duplicates that we find, so an email with attachments and we all save it someplace, right? We've got obsolete or old stuff, so why are we keeping things that are over 10 years old? Don't know. And we got trivial data, Game of Thrones videos that have been downloaded onto our storage devices. I, I tend to have some cat videos, but that's so <laughs> Exactly, and parties and whatever else, right? Family pictures, look, my kid got an A in the first grade. Wonderful. But 
you're paying for all that storage and why are you paying for that? So initially we come in and we can reduce storage costs by 20 to 30% right off the bat. In fact, Gartner says 80% of unstructured data is not useful to the business, 80%. That's Gartner saying that, not us. We see initially 20 to 30% reduction. So that in itself pays for what it would cost to run classify on a three year basis. So there's your ROI right there. Exactly, I mean, out of the box. And then we start solving all the real business problems of classifying data for all that private data that shouldn't be exposed. And I think that's what this is all about, right? Exactly. Being able to mitigate that risk. Mitigate uh, risk. Sounds like a, a great solutions offering running in the cloud or on premises. Yep. Any uh, uh, any other, anything else you'd like to add? Well, you know, if you want to talk to us about helping out your company, contact us at your early opportunity. We'd love to talk with you. Uh, what's a URL? Congruity360.com? Congruity360.com. That's a nice easy one. Thank you guys for watching from Pure Accelerate 2019 in Austin, Texas. We appreciate the partnership. Great. Thank, Thank you, you, Steve. Thanks for having us.